you, audience, it's time to pink about it. You know, all month long here at Wendy, we've been featuring stories about people doing their part to spread awareness about breast cancer. Now I'm here with Lexi and her mom, Julie, and Josie and her mother, Shannon. Lexi, <laughs> what, what is it that you're doing to, um, to make awareness of breast cancer research? We, we are collecting pink and white friendship bracelets, and we're going to give them to kids touched by breast cancer so they know that they're not alone. Like these bracelets. These are wonderful. Remember, we used to make these in camp. Yes, nice job. Oh, thank you so much, Josie. How is this helping you? Um, this is helping me because when I see other kids wearing these bracelets, it makes me feel like I'm not alone, and I know what they've gone through. Yes. Now, Shannon. Shannon is a breast cancer survivor. Tell us about why it's so important. Birthday as well. Yes, thank you. Tell us why it's so important to get our children involved in our breast cancer research and survival. Well, as you know, I'm a breast cancer survivor, and it actually, like when the kids wear the pink and white bracelets, yes. it's kind of like they're in a hidden club. They kind of, um, they don't feel alone. Yes. You know? Very right, nice. Yeah. Very nice. <laughs> well, I appreciate you guys being here today. These are really, really good. And if you want more information on how you can help out, with your pink and white friendship bracelet and make a donation, go to wendyshow.com. Thank you, girls. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I also want to thank Lisa Renna and Harry Hamlin for being here today, as well as Jesse Metcalf and Fran Drescher, and of course, you, my studio audience, on tomorrow's show. The lovely Joan London will be here tomorrow, along with the horror master Wes Craven and a, a fry chef who fries the most unusual things. It's going to be a good show. I love you for watching today. See you next time on Wendy. Yeah.